if we're talking about the NBA, and, and we mentioned Madison Square Gardens, <laughs> one of the prime times. So this is New York City when it also was the home of professional sport. A shrine, if you will. Look at this. Listen to the names. Listen to the names on this team. So let's go back a ways. But this, this was prime time, a show time, property of the NBA and perhaps the NBA broadband properties. But Walt Frazier, to me, that was that was the definition of cool. 1970. Game seven. Knicks. Dave DeBusher. Oh, you've gone right to the beginning. Dave DeBusher. Nice warm-up jackets, too. I like the NY on it. Yeah. Yankee the, style. Wasn't that cool? I mean, look yeah. at that. It doesn't even look the same thing. They probably called them the Knickerbockers back then. Sure they did. Knickerbockers. <laughs> Who wouldn't we call that? Don't say that word fast too many times in yeah. a row, eh? So Willis Reed, by the way, was just... Look at that. It still has that aura. It's too bad that the team's not there. But Walt Frazier was it for me as a kid. No one looked that cool. Listen to the ovation. That's the type of applause that has been reserved for boxers like Sugar Ray Robinson in the Old Garden, Tony Zale and Rocky Graziano, and a host of other great fighters. So there are the Knickerbockers, the Knicks coach there by Ben Holtzman. The Knickerbockers. Now, uh, get ready to move into the center. But look who along takes... Along with Reed on the left, number 19, Chamberlain, the handshake. The sweat man around his brow. Richie Powers throws it up. Chamberlain gets control. Willis Will Reed Chamberlain, he, he was the only one who floor. jumped that now ball. He's the only one who jumped. For Los Angeles, number two. Number 22 is Elgin Baylor. Elgin Started Baylor. Busher and Baylor shot De Busher. It's taken by Bill Bradley. The next pass break Bill Bradley. Uh, Frazier. Who became uh, a senator. Picked up by Jerry West. That's right. Jerry West. Mr. NBA. Yeah. Willis Reed. Willis Reed. Okay. Just some of those moments. When I when I look at that, I think, oh, it must. It just must rip the heart out of, of those in New York. True Knicks fans. Because that, that was the Knicks to me. What? Just become best friends. Yep. 